Christmas display in Butte is bringing an old neighborhood back to life. That's right. The Mining City's historic Meterville neighborhood was literally swallowed up by the earth. MTN's John Amy has the story. Butte's once bustling Meterville neighborhood literally vanished without a trace. You feel sad for the people that never had to see it. You mentioned it to the younger generation, Meterville, where was that at? They don't even know where it's at. This is where it was, slowly swallowed up by the Berkeley pit when the Anaconda Company started doing open pit mining in the mid-50s. The company bought the people out and they closed everything down. These three men are the last of Meterville's volunteer firefighters who helped build Meterville's famous Christmas displays back in the 40s and 50s. The main highway went right through Meterville from Butte to Helen. Other people have stopped. They had cars backed up there for half a mile or so waiting to get in to look at the thing. <laughs> Meterville was a close-knit community, mostly made up of Italian immigrants. Everybody had vegetable gardens and gave one another stuff. Well, Meterville may be long gone, but Chris Fisk and students with the Butte History Club brought back a little piece of the old neighborhood by recreating one of its historic Christmas displays right here at the Racetrack Volunteer Fire Department. It's a way of bringing the old neighborhood back to life. We love we love to have Meterville back. But now only a memory. In Butte, John Amy, MTN News. I had no idea. What a great story. It's a great history in Butte. Uh, that's kind of a sad part of the history, yes. along with the uh, community of McQueen also met a similar fate. Wow. But the Christmas ornament's awesome. Yeah. Thanks, John.